Welcome back to another podcast. Today, put your fucking hand down. I already hit the table. We're going to be talking about the best movie that we've seen, in our own opinion, opinion, mm. that came out from January of this year to right now. So that includes, oh, shut the fuck up. that came out. Includes Batman vs. Superman, uh, Civil War, mm. what was the other summer Everyone's blockbuster, seen. Suicide That's Squad, fun. shit like that. So... My idea. I'll start us off, ready? Go for it. Go for it. Uh, well, Civil War was fucking great. Yes. But I'm not going to take that one because it's obvious. Yes. I'm going to go with the one that's right there. And it was called Sausage Party. Oh, great. I went and saw Sausage Party. You guys seen it? Not yet. Not yet. They got incredibly good reviews. I went, I was in line with my girlfriend to go see it. And there was a dad and his a son and his daughter. Like, uh, like. No, 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 no. I, like, like, they were like. I don't know, 16, 17. Okay, like I was they like were young. They were like cobblers. I was like, like younger um, than are they bringing like baby? Let's go see the movie. No, no, no. They were like they were, they were older. Okay. And we were in line right behind them, and the clerk's like, "Hey, this movie is really R-rated. There is a big sex scene in it." I was like, "Sex scene with food? What the fuck are we talking about?" So the dad was like, "No, we're not gonna go see it." And they left the theater. I was like, "Shit!" <laughs> so I went and bought tickets and I got in there. God damn. It wasn't a sex scene. It was a fucking like five minute long food orgy. Like, there, was, <laughs> food orgy. there was food fucking food. It didn't matter if you were dude food. You were still fucking dude food. What the like, hell? There was like a, a, a pearl necklace getting pulled out of a bun's ass. And there was a taco <laughs> eating a bun out. Anal beads. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck is going on at the end of that movie. Oh my Sorry. god. Dude, we gotta go see something party. But god damn. It's really fucking religious that way. When you get into it, it's real religious. Otherwise, it's, it's a really good movie. Huh. Other than that, Civil War is probably the best movie I've ever seen in my life. It really might. My... Besides Batman. Uh, you know Batman. what? Since you already mentioned it, I want to go next. I was like, you say first Superman, I'm going to bitch slap the hell out of you. Batman vs. Superman, Suicide Squad, Sausage Party, <laughs> Civil War. There you go. All right. Since you already stole my favorite. I'm I didn't steal it. Okay. I said it's my favorite, but I'm going to do the second favorite. Civil War is my favorite this year. Hands down. Okay. Black Panther. Panther. Yeah, Black Panther and Spider-Man, obviously. The new Spider-Man was badass in that. And I honestly... He had more screen time than the Joker in Suicide Squad. Oh. Well, yeah. Obviously. <laughs> more lines. <laughs> and more lines. Shitload more lines. Hell, he had more lines than Joker, Batman, <laughs> and uh, Flash. Marvelous. And Captain Boomerang all put together. Marvel's and so Killer good. Croc. And Killer Croc. And Slipknot. And Slipknot. Yeah. <laughs> Did Slipknot even have a fucking line in that movie? What? Oh, I'm please. not gonna talk about it. Actually, yeah, he did. He had one. Yeah, he won. It's probably ah, as he got yeah. fucking fucked up. <laughs> He's like, hunt, go. <laughs> Anyways, Marvel, they're just so good at creating characters. Yeah. Now, like, for real. Now, what do you mean? You seen the Hulk movies? And Iron Man one. Yeah. Iron Man one was great. Yeah. That was a hell of a movie. Iron Man one. Iron Man three. Yeah. Too yeah. much action. <laughs> go ahead. It's like a freaking. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> I would still like it. It had a better plot than Batman vs. Superman. At least it had a story. Down. And at least it made sense, but it was story. way too much action. Way too much action. Oh yeah, Civil War. Black Panther is badass, and so is Spider-Man. Black Panther was badass. That's my favorite. Dude, yeah. whenever they said Civil War and Spider-Man's getting two suits, I was like, he's going to get his original suit, and he's going to get Iron Spider. I can't fucking wait to see Iron Spider. It's going to be a new movie. But it's going to be a new movie. It's not even Civil War now. Dude, if they would show Iron Spider in Civil War, I would say nasty. I would, yeah. I would. <laughs> ah! Anyways, I think Tom Holland's going to be my favorite Spider-Man. He's the most like the comics. Like, the other characters are nothing like the comics. Like, Tom Holland portrays it like the comic book. Like, exactly. Like, he's kind of like Deadpool where he never shuts the fuck up while he fights. Yeah. It's awesome. All right. Speaking you're, of you're Deadpool. Deadpool. That's my choice. Hell yeah. Deadpool. Good choice. Yeah, that'd be my top three. Oh, yeah. What I like about it, though, there wasn't, like, that much story. Like, there was story, but it was all over the place a little bit. But that's how Deadpool is. Not really. Like, the story was... Like, he, like if you portray it through, like, what actually happened during the time that the movie started to where it ended that part of the story, it's a 30-minute movie. There's a, yeah, there's a solid story, and it's just that it's all throwing its comedy in there, too. It's all flashbacks and cutaway, but that's what Deadpool is. It's all cutaways and flashbacks. But also... That movie was, it was just, it flowed. It was a good movie. Yeah, so. it flowed like a Deadpool movie should. That's why I got good reviews. Yeah. I'm not 
killing it. But I love like a movie shit. Yes. <laughs> That's the best way to put it. Hey, so, the last, wait, the last Wolverine movie was great. The one where he's in like Samurai. China. Samurai. So to end this, real quick, pick a side, DC or Marvel? Marvel. Marvel. Hands down. Marvel.